In this video, we will discuss about a security model, Pela La Pudela. This security model was basically made for defense services. And this model supports the data that needs to be confidential. So this security model was made to, to support confidentiality. In this model, there are three things, three very important layers, top secret, secret and confidential. As you can see here in the flow, the Bob who is working on top secret position can read the data of allies because allies is working on secret position and allies can read the data of Dave who is working on confidential position but Dave cannot read the data of allies because Dave is working on confidential position and allies cannot read the data of Bob because he is working on secret position so per person who is working on top position can read the data per of the person working on below position In this model, there are three parts. The first part is simple confidential rule. And the second part is star confidential rule. And the third part is strong star confidentiality rule. In simple confidentiality rule, the person, there is no read up. Let's take an example. If the person working in a company on the position of manager, managerial director, managing director, another person is working as a sales executive in sales department. If the person can have access to all the documents of a person who is working as a managing director, so the document will not be confidential because if the person working on sales executive position can see the personal documents of a person working on managerial director position, it can make a problem in company. So to stop this, so this rule is here, a simple confidentiality rule. Let's take another rule, star confidentiality rule. In this rule, there is no write down. Let's take an example to understand this rule. If there are two persons working in a company, one person name is Peter Arneson. He is working as a financial head. And another person name is also Peter Arneson. And he is working as a financial executive in the same department. And the Peter Arneson got fired. And now the HR is HR wants to write Peter Arneson, who is the head of that financial department, to take a review meeting on the person they just fired. So, with the both the person have the same name, in this situation, the HR by mistake wrote an email to the person who is working as a HR, who is working as a finance executive in the same department because the both have the same name. So, to stop this, this rule is here star confidentiality rule let's take a, another example to understand the third rule no read write up down so in this rule if somebody is working as a financial head and another person is working as a HR head they both can write to each other they both can read and write to each other because they both are working on the similar level but the person in HR department, one person is HR head, another person is HR executive. They can't write or read to each other if there are, if there are some documents that are very confidential. So in this rule, the person who is working on the similar level can read and write to each other. Thank you to watch my video. Thank you.